you all ready to go here, folks? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's play a game. Why did I see arrows knocked on the end there, Chancer? <laughs> let's get that arrow off. Cheater. Exactly, we don't want that. So, no! <laughs> Draw! <laughs> Loot! Gotta oh say, God. like, seen better Mine starts. Next arrow. Ready, 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 guys. No. Ah. Wait, you said the first three. Draw. Three. No way. Okay, so <laughs> two on the ends, minus. just about on time. Just Next time way. anyone asks me to wait, there will be minus points added <laughs> on here. That's the way we're going. And from, have I said knock, draw, or loose yet, Chancer? <laughs> right. Flip me ears. <laughs> Eager arrow on the end there. Chill out. Eager Drop it back on in. Drop it back on in. <laughs> so, just take the arrow off the, off the knock there. Take right. your eyesight so good. <laughs> Listen, I, I know, all right, Chancer? Exactly. Come on. So, no breaks now. Have I said knock yet? That was me here in that time, got that one. <laughs> I can hear it click too. Oh, no! Draw! Loot! <laughs> yes! hey, stop, 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 stop! That's one for me, thank you very much. No, I'll take that, there we go. So, next arrow. Knock! Draw! Loot! Lovely sound. Now yes. we're getting closer. Last Lovely. arrow. You did well. So, you're going to qualify with two. No! Loot! Yes! Yes! So... Oh, no, what about that? Bullseye to finish it. Yeah. Nice work, nice oh, work. Yeah, I might have been so to begin with. Nice. Here we are then. Nice. I can't work under pressure, man. Do you, I see some <laughs> people crumble. <laughs> so, get me over your bows here. We'll take them on over. We'll drop them over to the side. May, I think you're getting we'll your head chopped. Head on over here. <laughs> you, you've uh, lost. I'm pretty sure oh, May is gonna get. She's making a run for it. Joffrey, come back. <laughs> <laughs> May, you're about to be Ned Stark. Ready? Oh. So I've got to say here, ladies. So May and Amina. No distinctive winner here. Goodbye to both of you. Good well, riddance. What we're, what we're going to have to gonna do be is beheaded do together. playoff here. Oh. So what we're going to do is head back on up there, grab your oh. boat. Oh. May, away. it's a playoff. The furthest from the bull will have her head removed from her. Oh my god. That sounds promising. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, cruel world. Well, going to be it here. So Zainab, come on ahead on up here until we get this. Zainab, could you want you have to stop? Should I don't? <laughs> Bring it on! <laughs> <laughs> I have to watch the so this, this one here. Here's the other boat. I don't remember what my uh, this one's mine, I think. So. Yeah, yours is the yeah. last boat. Yeah. That one I think is Ready? Before, I? So we're gonna be one arrow each. Come on, little finger. Let's see so... how well you do. Kiss my ass. <laughs> <laughs> John's right. ready. Hey, and then hold that. Rules over there. It's still not hold on. Uh, no Stop cheating. cheating! I think she should be disqualified just for cheating. Well, her, her arm should be chopped off. I think. I think. <laughs> okay, people, not your head. I think people who are run about saying what other people should or should not have happen should be doing that sort of thing, oh. or else we're going to bring that person back into the oh. I got told oh. off. <laughs> no. Already, because I can't even do it. Yeah. Draw. Wait, wait, wait. I'm in the spot. Yes! Woo! Yay! Unlucky. Unlucky. You got so your head chopped. You lost your head. What's happening? Nice shot here. So, bullseye, they, they win the head back. Yeah. <laughs> they win the head back. You, you get to keep your scarf on. But I want to give you your last arrow. She's going to be Ned Stark, so, isn't she? Exactly. You're going to be Ned Stark, Stark here. Stark. <laughs> Robert. Thanks, Cersei. Yeah. <laughs> Lord Mormont. Tony, when I back the There's no more tea for you, Ned. Are you ready? 
Do you have any last words? Yeah, listen, the winner's chopping the loser's head off. <laughs> oh! Oh! oh. Yeah. This has been hurting you. Tell the green. For being a terrible archer. For being a terrible archer. For letting Winterfell be overrun by our enemies. Oh! Winterfell be overrun by our enemies. Then we look at running off from the wall. Ready? No. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dude, give oh. our last words. Give our last words. Oh. For goodness sake, you gotta give it yeah. our last Goodbye, words. Goodbye, cruel world. Well. <laughs> I don't want to be here in the first place. Pretty good one. Let's see how it is. Ah! That's my hair. It's, yeah. real. <laughs> it's not real, mate. <laughs> Go on. She's gonna hit me, man. Oh. Oh. <laughs> how many times? Oh. You're doing oh. what Theon oh. did. Oh. It's not working. I need to. Theon. Kick it off! <laughs> He's back from the dead. <laughs> You're a white now, baby. You look a bit white. <laughs> you can't spank her. What kind of game of thrones is this? This one will get melted down to two then. Oh, why? Well, you see? Do you, you need a job, do you? <laughs> got the archery skills, got the trivia, you know what I mean? What's the nonsense? Oh, exactly. Sit brown, it's alright! Diversity! Well, we do need a few outside, or a dog screamer, you know, charging in on the horse. Nancy you know, you can be a dog turkey, I'm man. Dead. I'm dead. Dead. D E D, dead. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, I'm here. Just vlogging at the same time. You know how it is. Woo! Wow, this is so awesome. I have not ridden on this yet. I did a chance to like see. So beautiful. This is why I love it. Wow. Look at that. Awesome. That's not a dire wolf. <laughs> it's beautiful though, it's a gorgeous dog. Okay, we've reached one of the locations on the map, one of the filming locations. So, what's this, guys? You've also arrived at location 8. This is the site of Rob's camp, where Rob is preparing to cross the bridge of the twins to save his father, Ned. He finds out he is a man like his father, values, honesty and integrity. Oh. He realises there's more than just beauty. She has brains, skills and secrets to explore. Take a walk in their shoes, perhaps even fall in love. We've had more than one marriage proposal here at Winterfell. Oh. This is where Rob and Talisa go for a walk. That, this tree right here, is where the three women are hanging. When Brienne takes them, takes Jamie, and they come across the three bodies, and then she wants to take them down, and then three Stark guys come, and she says, I hope you gave them a quick death. And uh, the guy says, yeah, two of them. Ooh, wrong answer. Because then Brienne gives two of them a quick death and one a slow one. Can I climb onto the tree? You may not climb onto the tree, Please? my lady. No. Me? I've already got a scarf on. <laughs> do it, do it. Never no, mind, forget that. It ain't worth my life. I don't want to be brand. <laughs> <laughs> down you come. Come on. I don't know how to get down. Wait. Okay, yellow, I'm all let's go. We'll have to Wait. call the red lady. Oh! Wow, how they CGI'd it all. It's the original. Look how they CGI'd everything. This is where Tyrion's like coming along here whistling. Not Tyrion, Bronn was whistling. Mm -hmm. well, no, no, Tyrion was whistling and mm. then Bronn was like. Mm. And then he says, and then Tyrion says, what do you want? That's Gold, mine. women, That's mine. golden women. That's just along here. Whatever. 
What evidence can you use to betray me? I'll, I'll pay you double. Oh, we're going to Waldefrey's castle. I don't want to go there. That place makes Mother? me. Mother? Makes me heart hurt. Well, Mother. Rob was warned. Rob! Rob! Rob was warned. And then she's like. Ugh. And then someone comes and goes. And then she kills the wife anyway. Yeah. That made me want to stop watching for a while. I was like, how could, how could you do that? How? So the clip we just saw was filmed here. Do, 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 do. The they did, the yeah. And then they, where they CGI'd. That's for the stuffing. For the Lannister army. Right, next. Let's head on. You see, that's the tall tree. Right. So they CGI'd a bridge across there. Oh, hang on. Let me take you there which is the bridge that Rob has to cross Ooh. to save Ned Stark but of course the one that the one that he needs to um, the CGI it here he basically gives away his freedom for access to this bridge he agrees to marry Waterface's daughter yeah he agrees to but this bridge. of course before that can happen he goes and goes and marries someone else and there's a red wedding by the way, what happens to that his uncle who ends up marrying one of Walder Frey's we'll daughters? Out. Are we going to find out? Oh, <gasps> so that's where it that's happens. Um, Captain Stark's brother. Yeah. Okay. Come on then. What's the next one? We're going to number fourteen, which is all the way back from where we just came. All right. Really? Back up the trail. Oh great. <laughs> <laughs> I'm quite looking forward to doing downhill. <laughs> Is this, that means this is all going to be uphill. Yeah. That's Walder Frey's castle. The tall tree in the distance is the headline. It's the line of sight for the bridge here on the twins. Arya's on her way here. She wants to meet up with her family once again. That's also where the Theon shoots down the crow, crow that Walder Frey's right. using. Are we going to the top, guys? She's not sure what to expect. She's been away now for three seasons after all. She's gone through things that no young person or anybody should ever have to go through. And finally, at the end of the tunnel or oh. the river, as the case may be. This is about Arya. Like she's finally can dare to okay. hope for something good to happen to her again. Oh yeah. This is somebody who is she knows she's not gonna make it in so time to do And all but lost any hope that something good can happen to her. She's very wary of putting herself So they said that most of the scenes that were in building, indoor scenes, were shot inside a studio and they used sites like this only when they were filming from the outside can you believe what these with buildings have withstood through the years it's made of stone this is the perfect opportunity for you to don your cloak, draw your sword and create your own red wedding oh no thanks why would I want to create my own red wedding I did it why do you always get my throat? <laughs> Mother! Mother! Oh, <laughs> Nancy! Getting a bit passionate there, girl! <laughs> hey? Oh, this is where Rob and Talisa get married. Oh, yeah! At that tree! Oh, Rob. You love of a woman. Yeah, foolish, foolish, Rob. Since around 1000 AD. Mother! <laughs> <laughs> since the 1500s and today it's even coming back especially in Scotland this proposal took place because Rob wanted to marry the woman he loved and not as a bribe to secure the crossing of the bridge of the twins of one mm. of Walter Frey's ugly daughters he followed his all right ugly kid. daughter how does he know that ugly marriage vows? So this is where go on that's Same where Rob be. and Talisa got Father, married. Warrior, oh, it would be so sweet if somebody were to propose the there. Stranger. I am his. By the tree. Such a nice proposal. The Aren't they? Um, uh, don't you want a uh, you know, you uh, new one? He's getting doomed. The what? Yeah, Married to the knife is the doom. Oh. Varen, you Yeah, actually, there. Marriage oh, really doesn't end with it. You know she's Charlie Chaplin's granddaughter, Talisa. Bit of fun facts for you there. Look 
Where the hand is uh, telling you, Kerr, what you worry for, still there. It's going to be there when you get there. Yeah. But she knows, she has a sense about it. She's never going to see her mother again. Come on. Uh, our thighs are going to be built like stark men. Who's with me? Come on, you wildlings! <laughs> no. Well, you know what? He's a realist because the only brown people are the savages. No, we could be the Dothraki. Actually, no, the woman from Dawn is. Yeah, yeah. But she's a villain, though. Dothraki. Why don't they have any good brown people? She just wants power. How is that villainous? Robert's a villain as well. True. The Starks want power too, don't they? They all want power. There's a shrine here. Shrine? No, it's, it's a bit further out. It's maybe about 50 miles from here. It's, do, have you heard of Newry? No. Newry is right on the border. So if you want to come up from Dublin, you've got to pass through Newry on the border. Mm-hmm. But there's, oh, good, there's a... Good. We're going to pass it. Are you heading down south, are you? Yeah. Then yeah. you pass, pass Newry. There's a wee town called Jonesboro, and there there's a shrine called St. Bridget Shrine. Now, St. Bridget, she was... So, whenever Patrick came, a lot of the gods and goddesses of Ireland became saints. Mm -hmm. So, Bridget is a saint now, but she was a goddess of Ireland beforehand. So, she was sort of like a springtime goddess, fertility goddess. She's got a festival day, which is the first day of spring every year and all the rest of it. But there's a wee shrine down there with a load of healing stones. Mm -hmm. And there's like a stone that's shaped like a hip that's supposed to heal your hip if it's sore and you know one that there's like a wee eye well you can heal your eye and stuff and there's a whole story behind it but it was down one day do i go all around these places and i check out the old circles and i you know do a bit of writing about them all the rest of it and this one I was down doing a gig and i was going to go to the circle and sleep over and then go explore it the next day mm. so i sort of got a bit sidetracked got way off the way off from where i was going to sleep ended up getting sidetracked again back to the circle or back to the stones which was a bit creepy and at that time I had this wee caddy van it was all done up in the back and I used to be able to sleep in the back so I'd go to the places and just sleep in the back and camp out so I was lying sleeping in this wee caddy van and it was the middle of the night and there's all these stones, old stones about and like this old shrine and all you know an old catholic shrine and things about as well and uh, I was lying there sleeping, parked my van right back up against this wall. So the wall itself was like blocking the door being open. Mm. So back the van back right back up to there. And I was just lying sleeping. Next thing, I woke up like in the middle of the night and I looked out the window. And there was this figure there. And it was like, it was the creepiest thing I've ever seen. Male, female, head over. Describe Heart, what? Walk up. <laughs> Wild walker, walker. Yeah. Did it have like Wild hair? Did it have like long hair? Like the ring style? Yeah. Yeah. Ring style? Yeah. Sort of looked like, sort of like that. Did like, you see the feet? No, because the van was, the window was here. That's your taxi mm -hmm. official story. But the window was about here and I could see from about here down. And it had like long greasy hair. Ooh. Big like open sores all over its face. I couldn't see its eyes or anything like, but I could see it standing there. What did you do? Did you scream? No. Come in. So, I, so uh, I keep my, my knife and my torch with me at these places because like this, this, this is the cra there's crazy stuff that happens to me everywhere, this sort of thing. So you got to keep that just in case like. So uh, I had the knife and the torch there and I thought, you know what is, fuck this, I am going back to sleep like I'm not dead with this, no bother. <laughs> so, yeah, exactly. So I just, I just grabbed the knife and I went back, tried to get back to sleep and the next thing I felt this hand reaching in. <laughs> No. from the front of the van and I was like fuck this so I just closed my eyes grabbed the knife closed my eyes and I thought you know what it is these are all healing stones around here I'm just gonna focus on the stones focus on all the good stuff people come here to get healing and the thing will go and that's what it did I got to sleep and all the rest of it you went to sleep after that thing grabbed <laughs> Yeah. No, fair enough. You had the right way. That if you're not scared of them, yeah, that's it. and you focus, they do go away. Well, Next true. time, I want you to look at their feet, because there's a there's a there's a kind of like a, I guess a mythical creature which is like a ghost slash yeah, yeah. like and it's their feet. an energy yeah. that um, is there in I guess it's in like 
Arabic or like Muslim sort of theology in a way. Yeah. I, don't if it's, I don't know if it's like scripture. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, it's called jinn. Anyway, jinn. Oh, yeah, okay. yeah. So it's called jinn, J-I-N-N or D-J-I-N. D-J-I-N. And um, they're, apparently they made a fire. And yeah. the way that you can tell it's them is if you look at their feet, the feet are the wrong way around. Right, okay. So next time, I check out the foot. She didn't see it once behind Oh my god, this sounds like so much fun. This is so up my alley. Yeah, I'm going to tell, oh, tell you what happened yes, the next day before you go. So the yeah. next day was Good Friday. Got out of the van, there was a wee woman there doing all the stations of the cross and all, you know, because it's a shrine and all yeah. too. And I got chatting to her, and she'd seen the guy out of the back of the van, and she says, she, she says to me, you know, did anything strange happen to you last night? Any incidents or anything? And I didn't want to go in there because I was bit freaked out, it was like, this is going to make me sound like a madman kind of story. It was like, nah, 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 it's all good, no problem, good sleep, no bother, down on. And she says to me, well, the reason they asked, I asked her why, and she says, well, the reason they asked, she's going to tell me what, she, she sort of stopped and says, let's just say the devil comes to places like this. And that was all she said. Oh. Whenever she said that, I was like, oh. right, I'm away off for a fray here. <laughs> Goosebumps. <laughs> But yeah, there's a wee story for you. Crazy. Story. Yeah. Listen, Jamie, thank you yeah, so no much. Worries, it was lovely no to meet you. Yeah, lovely yeah. meeting you. We had um, such a good time. Thank yeah, you. Good you luck with your um, Here, listen, do you, do you adventures. Mind? Thank you very much. Can you just, do you mind just popping your details on there? Just yeah. so I can go on. I know you got all your yeah, followers yeah. and stuff. Yeah, and yeah you can follow her. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm like a wee well, self if you have, those her. And leave a comment. Leave a comment so I can follow you. Because I want to know what you get up to when you go to America and pursue your acting and you'll become a superstar. I will See what happens. All right. Okay. See you on the red carpet. See you later. Have a good show. Bye. Bye. See ya. See ya.